I scribbled this down on a piece of paper right before I left the house. So, as a maid of honor, I figured I should speak. And my heart is beating fast. Give me a second. Okay. <clears throat> One of my most favorite positive affirmations, I have positive affirmations all over my house. If anybody's been there, they've been in my bathroom, you've seen them all over. One of them is, letting go of what no longer serves you opens you up to receive the new gifts that life has waiting for you. And Sharon had the courage to listen and to feel that in her heart. And Tom was able to come in to her life and bring her incredible joy. We can either make ourselves miserable or we can make ourselves strong. The amount of work is the same. Love shouldn't hurt, it should feel really good. And the love that Tom and Sharon have is an example to every single person in this room. And I was so honored to be part of this celebration. And I can only hope that on every single one of you, including myself, someday. So I toast to my dear friend and neighbor, Sharon B.C., and I welcome Tom Minor, Sharon B.C. Minor, <laughs> to our neighborhood with Syria Lane, because that's what it is, and if any of you watch Desperate Housewives, you will know what I'm talking about. <laughs> because whether we're married or single or intermissioned, uh, we are at one, at the unity in our neighborhood. So, cheers to the bride and And I know that Tom's brother has more that he would like to offer as well. So let's welcome Dick up here. Cheers. <laughs>